insights of the systems that you're building. Um, incidentally, to the extent that it's readable, um, these presentations are all uh, written in code. Uh, I, as a little experiment for this conference, uh, the presentations, I tried building the presentations using Reveal.js. Has anybody used Reveal.js before? It's a, uh, it's a, it's a very simple uh, JavaScript library that allows you to um, set, up, set up a web page um, and uh, each slide is effectively an HTML section and uh, the JavaScript does slide transitions and that kind of thing. So if you want to have, if you want to have the experience of writing, uh, building your presentations in software, it's a good way to try it out. And so incidentally, this presentation, all the other presentations that I've given at this conference um, are up there on my, uh, on my GitHub account. So if you want to check out the source, you can do so and, uh, and follow along. Um, and if you want to dabble a little bit in Reveal.js yourself, this is an example of something that you could use. Um, if you have some suggestions for improving the presentations, please feel free to uh, fork my repo and uh, you can send me a pull request and I'll evaluate it and potentially integrate it into future versions of this presentation. So this is the presentation that I'm actually most excited to give at this conference. And so um, I hope you guys enjoy it as well. Let's just see, see how many more people are going to come in before we get started. Um, so I started by asking a question of how many people code. Most people, uh, I think pretty much everybody put up their hand. Uh, what language do you use? How many people here use uh, Java? OK. All right. And how many people use Ruby? What about, what about JavaScript or server-side, like doing development in Node.js? Anybody use Node.js? OK. Yeah. JavaScript, yeah. OK. So the, the code examples are in Java. So at least the Java people will be happy. And I think that the, the non-Java developers out there will, uh, will be able to follow along pretty easily as well. So my, my Twitter handle is XORTEC. I encourage you to...